Good morning, Libra. On this Saturday, it's almost May. I'm trying to adjust this, but it's not cooperating. That's okay. You get the gist. I don't know why I pulled out so many decks. I just kept pulling them. We're going to start with my personal deck, Libra Ship, and see how you do. Oof, I miss you on to pop out. But then I let go and it went back down. <laughs> oh, okay. I saw it. Oh, okay. Soil. You might be getting in the soil. Maybe you're planting your vegetable garden. You signed the contract to be here. Don't forget that, my love. So I think the contract, you must have signed a contract together with your love and you're both here at the same time which is awesome new and water i'm gonna stop right there on those and let's get some pasta tarot going i'm really glad i got these cards because i'll tell you I wasn't going to get them because I was like, oh, I probably won't like them. I love them. Uh, wow. Okay. Wow. All right. This one came out first. Page of Minuta. I'm going to put these where you can see them. I'm going to move these to the side. Oh, Lord. I don't want that falling to the floor. I'm just going to put these to the side. And then came the chariot. When someone realizes who you are, they might come full steam ahead. Because this soil, I thought it said sail. And the hermit. I think you're in hermit mode. That's why they know they have to come forward to you. You're not going to come to them. Not this time. And the seven of Corta is on the bottom. Everybody wants to eat off of your plate. What is Libra doing? What is Libra eating? What is Libra doing now? Where is Libra? I'm not going to take all those. I got the three of Corta and the knight of Corta. Someone's coming in. With an, orf, an offer, I'm sorry, I almost said offer, an offer for you. And three, the Empress and the King of Lunga underneath. Seven of Minuta. I think this person that's coming for you is getting advice from his own father. Don't let her go. That's what I heard. And here's the hanged man. If you don't go for her, you'll regret it for the rest of your life. Okay, so you have a gentleman coming in for you. This advice is coming from his own father. For some reason, I feel like his father knows how special you are. And he's trying to... Tell his son how special you are too, but I think he knows already. He didn't at first, but he knows now. If that makes sense. I got the light sears, tarot. Yeah, you're you're busy doing your own thing. Maybe self self repairs, self-upkeep to make your where you live pretty. You won't be there much longer, but you know, you want to be as pretty as possible. You are the empress. You're also in hermit mode. The chariot. You have the chariot. You have an offer coming in. All right. 
You got the Five of Cups, the Death, and the Six of Cups. You think at one point, this is past, present, future. At one point, you were really distraught about this situation. And you actually had to go through a death and a rebirth to come out of this mental state. And now, you just want to enjoy life. You want the best. And I think you're going to try something new. And here you go, the Two of Cups. You want that relationship. You want this offer coming in. The Lovers. The Moon. We just went through the Pink Moon, didn't we? I believe so. You know what? This is May, the month of May. This is when you're going to get an offer to be in a solid relationship. This is the love of your life, and it's in May that's going to approach you. And I can't believe this. Two of Wands, you've been waiting for this for quite some time. But you're working on your pentacles, and you will achieve the sun. You will have everything you want. Um, focus your vision. I just learned today, get yourself a notebook and write down 10 goals. 10 goals today as if it already happened. And when you turn the page and tomorrow you write your 10 goals, don't look at the first page. And you're going to do this. How many pages is that? 30 days? Make a commitment. Each day, take time to write your 10 goals and focus. And don't look back on the prior day and you are going to attract people, places, and things to get your goals a jump start, and you will achieve your goals. I just felt like I needed to say that goals are very important. Without goals, you will have nothing. You will accomplish nothing. If you have something to look to and remember, yes, these are my 10 goals. And yes, this is what I want. And you know, the dates and they might change a little bit and that's fine. Nothing is set in stone. Just have that vision. Keep your vision. And good luck. Let me know how that works out for you. And commit to it. Don't say, oh yeah, yeah, I'm going to do it. Go to the Dollar Tree. Get you a cheap notebook. And start writing those 10 goals each day. All right. Wealthy man. Wow. It's got a little Nick in it. <laughs> your, your name might be Nick. I don't know. I got crystals sitting up here on the pillow. All right. Great fortune and the gift. I'm telling you, set those goals and do it every day. Don't look back on the prior day. Keep writing your goals down and take action on them. It doesn't have to be big actions, just something. Adjudication might be gone. To get married, a child is involved. Maybe this is your wish. Since you were a child, since we had this card down here, reminiscing of when you were a child, maybe you want to bring back the things you wanted as a child and go for those goals. Message. We got these guys, well, this guy coming in. The chariot. And the knight of Corta person has a message for you. He might have tried to send, well, he had messages for you, but deleted them. He wrote letters to you, but never sent them. That type of thing. He knows what he wants to say to you. It's a start. It's a start. Ooh. 
Unexpected income. I think we're getting all the money cards. Wow. Okay, one more. Please and thank you, Spirit. I love this for you guys. Remember, you can have whatever you want. Bad health. Okay, I'm going to resort back to this gentleman. This person's father is in bad health and wants his son to be happy. And he knows happiness lies with you. Official person. Official person. This is an official person. An official person is overseeing this. You can see the cards. Wonderful. I'm try to keep it small instead of extending it over my bed. <laughs> I think this is a nice, neat package. I have my cup of hot water with a little bergamot. And that gets your allergies or anything else going and flushed out. You want that warm to hot water, as hot as you can take it. Not, you know, scolding, but you want to drink hot water first thing to get everything going. We have trust. You gotta trust. You have trust issues? Get over it. <laughs> trust that the system works. Wow. I trust that these cards are going bonkers. <laughs> if you have trust, have trust in yourself. Rely on yourself. Choose peace. Don't get all worked up. If someone asks you to make a decision, you don't have to make a decision right away. You can take your time and buy as much time as you need. You don't have to make a split decision. That's when most people mess up. You don't want that. Take your time. Especially if it's really important. Don't just give a quick answer without really thinking it through. It's very important to think things through. This way you have the inner peace that you need and you'll trust yourself more when you give yourself more time. Does that make sense? I hope so. We have let it go. Yeah, if something doesn't work out and I don't know, could be a job, could be a relationship. And you're like, you know, wow, when I first came into this job, I thought it was going to be this way, but now it's this way. And ask yourself, knowing what you know now, would you stay there or would you stay in that relationship? And if the answer is no, let it go or make other arrangements to leave. Do not waste your time. Time is very precious. Twin flame. This person coming in is your twin flame. Look at the swan. You're waiting for your swan to come in. Because you are a swan as well. And they make for life. So I was told. By a very, very smart man. Get at least two more on these. Maybe five more. We'll see. It's Saturday. So happy. So happy. And grateful. And thankful. Everything is working out for the best for you and I. Wow, okay. That did not want to go back in. And not only that, it like went way under the bed. Oh, yep, way under. Let's go. 
Positive change, I told you. Yeah, you gotta make a change if you're not happy where you are, no matter what aspect of the, your life you're looking at. Just ask that question, you know. I came into this maybe a year ago, maybe five years ago. Knowing what I know now, would I stay or would I cut my losses? And if you would stay, perfect. If you want to cut your losses, do so. Let it go. I'm telling you, you won't regret it. You got unexpected income coming. Ooh. Purification. Purify. All right. Purification. Purification within your body. Drink that hot water to flush it out. You know that mucus is the dis-ease in your body. If you have a buildup of mucus, that's what causes dis-ease in the body. Don't go run to the doctor now. You can look up online. You got Barbara O'Neill. Look up her on YouTube. Put whatever is ailing you, and there's a cure. You want to drink herbal tea, hot herbal tea. Find the blessings in your current situation. Are there any? If there are, I don't know. You got to weigh it, right? You are the scales. You got to, I mean, find the blessings in your current. Yeah, you can find blessings in any situation, but that doesn't mean you have to stay there. See what I'm saying? Clear and shield your energy. Yes. Don't let anyone come up in your energy to destroy it. Let go of those naysayers. Do not, do not, do not, do not pay attention to them. They're not going anywhere, but you are. Remember that. You got bigger fish to fry. Is that how they say it? Yes. My labors aren't going to put up with that. Shoot. <laughs> One more card, please and thank you. I am enjoying this read. Thank you for coming on this journey into another dimension known as the Twilight Zone. <laughs> you ever watch the Twilight Zone? I love that show. Even the, to this day, I still love seeing the episodes. They're so good. I mean, man, were they ahead of their time back then. I was just a child when I started watching that. Good stuff. Okay, one flipped within. Fertility. Pan. Peter Pan. Neverland. Fertility. You might be looking to have a child. Or a grandchild. Could be. Could be. I'm going to pull from Claude Monet. I think I'm going to split these. Shout. Oh, Ten of Cups is on the bottom. I just looked. Fortune, peace, and fulfillment. Peace. Choose peace. It says peace right here. All right. Let's split them. Ta -da. The devil. Temptation, abuse, and addiction. Stay away from that. If something's tempting you and you know it's not good, get up and go. You got better things to do than be tempted by the devil. I'm going to show you the splits. Ta -da! Temperance, harmony, abstinence, and patience. How long do you think people are abstinent these days? Abstinence brings purity within your temple. Knight of Pentacles. Efficiency, routine, and dependability. Be dependable for yourself. This is nice. I like this. Yeah, depend on yourself. Don't depend on anyone else to make you happy. You have to be happy. Take care of yourself. It's very important. 
Seven of Swords, Deception, Trickery, and Theft. Hmm. Maybe you feel in your current situation there's trickery going on. Deception, possible theft. That's why it's, it's a bad situation. Let's see what we got. The Fool, New Beginnings, Innocence, and Wonder. Very nice. Return to Innocence. Let's see. Nine of Swords. Regret, anxiety, and hopelessness. Mm -mm -mm. You gotta purify that. You gotta get out of that stinking thinking. Go for a walk. Go outside. Change your change your scene. Changing your scene can get you in a better mood and think positively. Don't be stuck in the muck. Four of Pentacles. Stability, conversation, and security. That's a four corners of a home. Security, stability, peace, love, and happiness. <laughs> Eight of Cups, weariness, restlessness, and away. And remember I said, I thought this said sail? Got that sailing boat. And of course, there's a lot of water in these cards. And we have that water card. You might be moving to a new location where there's water. You're close to water. Pull one more for you guys. The Empress. Beauty, fertility, and creativity. We just got the Empress before. That's double confirmation. You know who you are. Own it. That's wonderful. I love that for you guys. I love it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> I'm pull some Alice. Oh, Alice. There's someone here to see you. Clock time. Time, pressure, and a rush. Slow it down. Slow. You can slow down your time. Time is an illusion. It's a man-made thing. If you depend on time all your life, you will age quicker than you should. Oh, okay. It's always tea time. Eternity, endless moments, and repetition. Oh, she looks bored. <laughs> She's like, oh God, another tea time. All right. Tea is good. We just talked about tea. Wow. Message for a rabbit. Service to the animal world. Animals are very important to you. And vice versa. Lead the way. Be a leader. Show others how it's done. You can help others. And you will. Just like I'm trying to help you by getting that notebook and writing those 10 goals down. Choices, feeling blocked, restrained. I think that's from your current situation that you're planning to say, let it go. Wake up. It's your moment. Yeah. It's your moment to shine. Find the lesson. Discover the purpose in a situation. Trust that you are learning. Yeah, all these situations that you've been put through, you have learned, even if you might not realize it today, tomorrow, maybe a month from now, one day you're going to look back and be like, wait a minute, I was in that situation before and I know not to do that. I know not to do that again the way I did it back then. I'm going to do it differently. 
Keep your temper. Don't allow anger to rule you. Yes. Take deep breaths. Don't get emotional. Keep calm as a pond. You know how a pond's water is very calm? If you can have that inner peace, while other people get, like, <laughs> upset, if you keep the peace, then you know you have arrived. You have to be calm within, like a pond. I would like one more card, spirit, please and thank you. I'd like to thank all my ancestors, my guardians, my angels, Uriel, Michael, everyone who's been with me from the beginning. Much thanks. My alien family, I know, they must be proud. Walk through fire. And I'm still standing. And I bet you have walked through fire too. And you're still standing. Just for that, be proud of yourself. I'm proud of you. All right. Whoa. Is it nonsense? It's time to talk sense. Yeah, don't listen to people that talk nonsense. Don't listen. Just let it go in one ear and out the other. Don't mind them. They don't know any better. Even when they think they... Oh, wow. Oh, my God. Did you see that? I was going to shuffle and all these cards popped up into the air and fell to the ground. Keepers of the earth, you are not alone. Ancient ancestors stand beside you. I told you, I told you, this is crazy. Inner temple, devotion, tune into the portal of your heart. There you will find peace and comfort. Birthing a new age. Thank you, spirit. Thank you, thank you. Birthing a new age. Birthing new creations, dreaming a new world into being. You're going to have a new world. The crumbling. Why are you clinging? What are you clinging on to? Let it go. We got that card to let it go. Do not cling on to something that no longer serves you. It can actually make you sick. And we don't want you sick. The priestess. How are you being called to set up and lead? You're a leader. You're going to lead people to the new world. <laughs> I'm just astonished. These cards are amazing. You see her collar? Priestess. Look at all the animals around her. Very important. You're very, very important to be here. Do not forget it. You signed up to be here. And now you're here. Do not give up. You're going to make it. Lift within. Let's get. Ooh, the answer is no. Wait, postpone. Pause, say no. That's that buying time card. Don't answer right away. Just say no. I'll have to think about it. I'll give you my answer later, a later time, whether it's two days, a week, two weeks. Anna, grandmother of Jesus, seeding the light, laying foundations, a divine plan is in place for you. I need one more card, please, and thank you, spirit. Oh, 
Yes. The initiation, rite of passage, crossing the threshold. You know me and my thresholds. That's where magic happens. Your whole world can change by either crossing a threshold or avoiding it. That's up to you. And I do believe I have my threshold cards out here. I'm going to, yep, that's up next after the sea. Let's see what the sea has in store for you. And that's the water card that we pulled earlier. Hmm. Beauty, may your... May you perceive nature's artistry afresh. You are beauty. Oh, nice. Soothe. May you settle gently even as the wave breaks above. Make sure you submerge your body completely in the salt water. Several times. It will heal you. Receive. May you know you are worthy of the gift and of course, we had that gift card many layers before. But you're going to receive a gift and great fortune. You're on your way. Don't give up. Let the naysayers. I'm going to take those two. They're like, listen, they're sticking out. Just take them. Play. May you seek out fun and connection. Have some fun. Allow. May you soften into what is. It is what it is. <laughs> Aw. May you see the sublime in every day. Faith. May you trust steady your fears. May trust steady your fears. Do not fear anything. Oh, that was perfect. Present. May your sense, may you sense each shiver of the surf. Motion of the ocean. Believe. May the sea deepen your faith. A lot of faith in this read. You got to have faith in yourself. That's why I'm building this pyramid here. I'm not too sure. All right, here we have the threshold cards. Divine doors. One fell out. 